want to. You do it. I don't want to be killed. Did you get in a fight or something? Oh, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Got into an altercation. Ow. I already talked about it. I don't want to talk about it anymore. Amber's decision to appeal might turn out to be one of her biggest mistakes, and here's why. More details about how aggressive Amber was to her very own family have made the light of day, and a theory that this might destroy her appeal has not ceased from flowing around the web. Keep watching to find out what we know. A close relative to Amber has sold out information that we presume may ruin Amber's appeal chances. Jennifer Howell, chief executive and founder of the nonprofit The Art of Elysium and former employer of Heard's sister Whitney testified in a pre-recorded deposition and fans can't help but see how much this detail might completely ruin Amber's chance of winning the appeal. In her testimony, Howell mentioned a past email in which she urged Henriquez to tell the truth, with some now curious to know what else she said in her testimony. Moreover, Howell seemed to be close to Whitney and she was almost family or at least Whitney took her as one. So, it's logical to pay attention to her side of the story, isn't it? Anyway, during her recorded deposition, an email that Howell had sent to Whitney Henriquez in 2020 was mentioned and when asked why Howell had sent the email to Henriquez, she explained she was urging her to tell the truth. Howell explained, I've struggled very much with what to do in a situation that I love someone who I know is doing something very wrong. And I know that they're doing it because they're trying to protect their sister, and I'm trying to protect her, and I'm just trying to get her to wake up and do the right thing, which is to tell the truth. As publicly reported, Howell did not go on to explain in what way she thought Henriquez was not being truthful, but fans have concluded that Howell seems more credible than Whitney. Besides, Howell was also previously involved in proceedings of the 2020 case between Johnny Depp and the Sun newspaper. In the 2020 case, she made a formal declaration. In the four-page declaration, Howell explained Henriquez told her that Heard was an aggressor in a past incident. Did you get in a fight or something? Oh, <laughs> thank you. Got into an altercation. Ow. I already talked about it. I won't talk about it anymore. I can't believe Amber beat your ass. I know you could beat her ass. We're not going to oh, talk man. about that. Whitney, truth or dare. <laughs> Okay, did you really start the fight with your sister or did she start it? For real, for real, for real. We're not gonna talk about that. She yes. really did I'm whoop your butt. Oh, we're not talking about it. Yeah, I'm done. I guess I'm done talking about it. Also in the declaration, Howell discussed Depp's severed finger and that Henriquez had told her it occurred during a fight the couple had in Australia. Being Whitney's ex-boss and ex-best friend, Howell could boldly state that Whitney was terrified of the violent ways of her sister and feared for Johnny Depp's life. Isn't that insane? And won't this ruin Amber's chances of winning the appeal? And as you may already know, in a couple of deposition videos supporting Heard's DV allegations, the first witness to take the stand after Amber was no other than her sister Whitney, as she was asked to tell how she witnessed the relationship between her sister and Johnny Depp at first as well as hers. She said that at first, it was all perfect. But with time he started to display controlling and violent traits towards her and her sister. The actress' sister also talked about the stairs incident backing up her sister's story, but as she was declaring, fans couldn't help but remember the sworn declaration by Jennifer Howell. Howell had thought ahead of Whitney's alleged lies and she decided to send it to deny her declarations. According to Howell, Whitney confided to her that during that incident it was Amber the one she was trying to stop during the fight. Whitney told me she tried to stop her sister Amber from hitting and attacking Johnny on the stairs. Whitney said when she tried to intervene to stop Amber from going after Johnny, Amber nearly pushed Whitney down the stairs. She told me she was worried Amber was going to kill Johnny. Isn't that shady? And we are sure the members of the US jury will resit and yet find themselves wondering why so many points for Amber's defense argument don't add up. By appeals, let's see what fans think. A fan wrote, Amber Heard's appeal in VA is an uphill battle against Judge Asker if this is no longer about Johnny Depp. She is challenging a woman's professionalism and ability to uphold the U.S. Constitution, the law and due process. Hashtag Amber Heard is a liar. Hashtag Johnny Depp rises. While another fan added, destined to end up the same as the trial itself, trying to gaslight the world with her new evidence when no new evidence will be considered. It's not a new trial, though she's pretending it is. Nothing is considered but what was a trial that proved her abusive with malice. Don't forget that we only offer our opinions and not factual information as this is a free space of communication. Isn't it? See you in the next video. Bye.